What's up, y'all? On this episode of Backyard Off Grid, I will be showing you how to make a art project out of the pour with some glow-in-the-dark acrylic, and I will also be showing you the yurt that we set up today or this past week, and uh, what I did last week with the the beach trip that I went on and some car camping kind of adventure. And yeah, let's get to it. What's up, y'all? Welcome to another episode of Backyard Off Grid. Today, I'm doing a glow pour kind of project. So, I'm gonna just pour this out. Yep. Just like that. Ooh, it's kind of thick. <laughs> it's kind of old, but it's just glue. It's basically just glue. I shook it up and everything. So I got rid of that, at least most of it. Oop, nope, there's a big chunk right there. Damn it. I mean, dang it, this is supposed to be kid friendly. <laughs> Oh, we're just going to use the rest of that, because I have another thing I can use. I'm just going to use a straw and just use this thing to my advantage to spread this about. Yeah. Like I said, I'm not a professional or anything at doing art, but this just kind of helps my mood. So I'm not so depressed all the time. The key to survival is being happy and positive and having a good outlook on things here. No matter how messy or whatever it may get, you just gotta keep powering through. This is cloth, a cloth canvas. Anybody want to know? So, cotton or whatever. Once again, my art projects are just a way to yeah, decompress and not be so stressed out all the time. We can use some glow in the dark stuff here. And just add some generous amounts of glow and whatnot in there. make it super messy. Yep. And then add this color here. Yep. Just be all crazy with it. Nothing super fancy. And then uh, some orange, gotta have some orange. This might even make a nice project for uh, Halloween. Kind of drizzle it like that maybe. Oh yeah. Yep. 
There we go. Super nuts. Yep, just like that. Then add some green, of course, for adding all the colors. Maybe all except for pink. I don't know. We'll see. It's gonna be crazy. Crazy man, crazy. It's a little messy, but yeah, it's green. And what would we do if we didn't have any black in it? Gotta add some black. Make it look very 80s, I don't know. Gives it a nice little pop of color. There we go. It's kind of the result I was looking for, right? So yes, yeah, so where I take my little handy dandy straw and I can like kind of blow it around. Which that doesn't really work too well while doing it with the camera, but I can always take my straw and just kind of blend the colors together. Like this, a nice little kind of zebra thing, which is pretty cool. And circle it all around. Don't be too stingy with it. That's all there is to it. Should I do a pink heart? I could probably do a pink heart. Make it extra special. And do a pink heart. It's delightfully tacky anyway, so I think the pink might add a nice little 80s finishing pop to it. Shake that up real quick. And then just, yeah, kind of put a nice pink heart on it. Probably a few of them, big one and a tiny one. some pink hearts. What's up, y'all? Here I am opening the King Camp.
Yurkon 400 and we're going to get this thing set up for you to show you our yurk for our uh, little Airbnb listing. beach was too cold to go swimming so I just decided to continue on my journey. Thank you guys for sticking around and thank you for watching Backyard Off Grid. Peace out y'all.